Hi everyone, I'm your host Andre, and today we are going to unbox the Prusa i3 3D printer kit. So actually this is an upgraded version of the printer that comes with two rows of filaments, one SD card of 8 GB and an LCD for free. So if you want to check this out, you can find the link in the description below. I actually got it from Hong Kong with DHL. So let's see what we actually have in this box. So I'm going to start uh, unboxing it. So let's see what we have in here. Below this protection, I can find the packing list. We'll check if we have all these items. I can see some cables, actually a power supply cable and some others. And uh, let's see what these are. These are probably the filaments, the PLA filaments. I ordered a blue one, as you can see, and a white one, yes. So uh, now we have a pretty big box in another pretty big box so uh, let's get rid of that and see what we have in here as you can see here we have the box but first let's check out the two filaments as you can see we have here uh, the white one it's a PLA 1.75 let's see what's inside so yes it's white PLA, we put this right here, here, the same thing, but this time blue. So we'll put this right here. First, let's take the list. So So here is a list, we put it right here. And now let's check out the box. Oh, actually, this is another box. So, uh, first, let's see what we have there. So, let's make some room here. Uh, the first thing that I can see is probably the source. Let's see. Oh, uh, yes, it's actually the source. Let's take it out and see it. So, as you can see, it's the source, we'll put it right here, over this box. Uh, here we have a stepper motor. Uh, this stepper motor is for the filament, probably. You can see it right here. So we'll put this right here. Let's see what we have here. So, uh, here we have four stepper motors. Let's take this out. Put them right here. I'll show you one of them. They are exactly the same. This is the last one. So we put it right here. So let's put them right here. All of them. And let's see what we have next. So I can see here some electronics. 
So here it's the main board. And uh, probably this is the LCD. Yes, I think so. So here they are. Here we have some tools. Some normal tools, not something very special. We'll put them right here. So, uh, here we have some uh, nuts and screws. Here we have some sliders. Actually, I see two longer and five shorter. Here we have the extruder, uh, 0 0.4 extruder. And here we have other features like the nozzle and uh, a belt. Put it right here. Here uh, we have some uh, feed rods, actually, this one, and some lead screws. We'll put them right here. And this two tiny things. So let's get rid of this. Now that everything is in order, let's see what we have in this box. So uh, I can see on a USB cable and a DVD, probably with instructions. So we put this right here. And uh, so right here we have the acrylic uh, frame. A very resistant frame, it's very useful. And I actually can see also the hot bed. This is how the hot bed looks like. So uh, that's it for now. Now let's check out the electronics. So uh, right here we have the main board, this blackboard, with five interfaces for the five motors right here we'll put this right here so uh, here we have the LCD display as you can see we'll put this right here so I can see three red uh, board switches and switches uh, we'll put them right here and some cables and some plastic. As you can see everything is now here. This is actually the hot emitter for the extruder and uh, yeah this is it. So as you can see we have actually five motors. Three of them are for the axis X, Y, Z. One of them is for the extruder and uh, this is a separate one. This is actually the filament feeder. It's a motor only for that. Thank you for watching. If you want to see how all this gets the same mode, please uh, subscribe and follow me in the next video where I will show you how to actually build the Perusa i3 printer. So uh, thank you for watching and have a nice day.